Why would you say that? What? What was I supposed to do? Not say anything. You heard him. He was going to call the police. No, he wasn't. He was bluffing, and you fell for it because you're a fucking idiot. Why do you even care? Because you just ruined someone's life. Fesco almost killed Nate. That was his decision. Lexi had thought about that night a lot. How could Fesco be so kind to her and so violent towards Nate? She couldn't remember the last time someone her age asked her so many questions about herself. He actually cared about what she had to say. And then 10 minutes later, almost beat Nate Jacobs to death. And even if Nate deserved it, it was a horrible thing to do. It made her think about her entire life. How she's always been so passive. How she never had the courage to say anything. And even the time when she did get the courage to say something. Rue, you really need to get help. What, are you gonna tell my mom or something? Yeah, if you don't stop. Okay. She backed down. Oh. Hun. I don't want to scare you. But something happened to Rue. She's okay. She's okay. But I think she over. She hated herself for being so weak and passive and afraid. So a couple of days after Cal came over, she decided to say something. Think it's cute that I'm so fucking stupid, tired of being useless. I've been up for three days, everything is haunted. Everybody's evil and there's bugs inside the carpet.